Parrish and Waiters will jump it. Dennis Johnson. Oakley plays Parrish. Bird with the outside jump. It won't go. Michael Jordan the rebound. McHale plays Oakley. Parrish against Waiters. Curitan against Bird. Jordan hangs in the air. But this time of the game, we're just feeling each other out anyway to see what's going to work. Jordan from 18. That'll work. Yeah. All night if he stays up. Hardly's not on call. Jordan one on one with Dennis Johnson. Hangs in the air. Dennis. Now we see how we get a 63. Yep. Exactly like this. Against one of the best defensive players in the game, Parrish. That's because we, if we make a mistake, we forget it. We don't. We don't admit it. We don't even know. Jordan. <laughs> He's got eight. That's eight four. He got 28 in a loss against Washington the other night. Everybody talked about what a bad game he had. Now that was a tough shot. That it was. And it, basically, it was a power shot rather than a finesse shot. The one game you and I worked together last year was a Boston game. You made a great point that I had never considered. So many people say Larry Bird can't jump, but you bring out he really can. Yeah, I was talking to him about that in. Uh, one of the cleats that, that he did. Let's take a look at this uh, play here. See where the foul is. He ran to a crowd there. And some of us think he can't, or thought he can't jump. That is a prodigious leap. Oh, that's something. Jordan has all nine of the Chicago points, and I'll tell you, he's so good, you're not even surprised. Now, Jordan, uh, that's one thing he's going to not do. If he's going to keep this up, he's not going to get very many assists. Jerry Seastick. Larry Bird from 20. We might get into a scoring duel with him. Just take his shots when they come and do the things he always. That's one of the things you have to discipline yourself not to do. Waiters and Coulter. Now something will start happening. Jordan bang that one up too long. Waiters got it. Coulter lets it rip. Puritan pushed off, battling for the rebound. He's got Bird on the wing. Leaves it beautifully for Parrish. What a play. Jordan quickly on the attack at the other end. Outstanding one-on-one -on -one play that was. So Dennis played the extra defense on him all the way. Stored up. Now the injury you would have used in the game. You still got it. Great shot there. Oh, that was vintage Larry Bird. He's got nine. Bird against Curitan wheels left hand deal score it and a foul. Jordan against Dennis. It rimmed it wouldn't go another rebound Curitan. I think one of the reasons that Chicago get so many offensive rebounds is that George has made them so conscious of, of his play. Great move again by Bird. Bird for three didn't get any. Parrish has the rebound. That won't go. Look at that bird. He's everywhere. Tipped up and in finally by McHale. And just taking a rest. Yeah, I was in the backcourt having a good time. So what do you do? Uh, offensively, what do you think? Or will the officials actually back off? Michael Jordan with it up top. Changed his shot, missed his shot. It's off the deck, and Rick Carlisle had three seconds left in the quarter. If you're just a good player, cancel. Two, one. It's good if it goes. It goes. Go. Go. <laughs> As my old buddy Joe Dean would say, string music. At the end of the period, you score Boston 32, Chicago 25. <laughs> game in which Bird was ejected the other night for the Celtics against Milwaukee. Bird from 18, bottom of the basket. Yes. They must have fell asleep. Bird has 20. Bird spins by Kieran Shoulder, but he put it to... They're uh, down by 11 with 7.05. What the Celtics are making do is 
Good shot there. Boy, yeah. was that a good shot. Three guys on it. It's what, a, the, what the Bulls are, are doing now, they're not executing very well. And Doug and Collins wants to talk it over with his guy. Bill and I will join you next a week from tonight at Washington, where we'll look for the first we'll look for the first time this year. Sellers beats McHale, hangs in the air, missed the tip, gets another chance. That's blocked away. Jordan with it. Bird got a piece of that, a whistle, and a foul. Let's take another look at it right here, there. If the hands are part of the ball, it's not a foul, is it? On the road, it is. At home, it's not. Okay. I see. Michael Jordan makes the first. His first point of the quarter. He's got 16 in the game. 52-38. Boston leads it. You say the front line is jumping all over him or something? Wearing him out. Bird plays Jordan. Late whistle. Who's the foul going to be on? It's going to be on McKay. Well, they can't. Let's see now. With McKay established. Yes. He has 18. He's a 79 percent free throw shooter coming in. Five out of five tonight. McHale up top. Seasting with a minute left until half time. Bird shoots two. Bird and uh, Jordan seem to be having a little conversation. <laughs> <laughs> And there's, you'll never find a player that talks more trash, as they call it, out there in the court than Larry Bird. Or he talks to other guys, says, I don't know why you play, I don't know why they put you on me, you can't guard me, and stuff like that. Jordan hangs in the air, that was a nice shot. Coach Carlisle really gave him a shot as he jumped. 21 for Jordan, that's his first field goal since the three-pointer to end the first quarter. Ten seconds left. Bird is mugged and fouled. Let's take a look at Michael Jordan. Let's see. David third kill about to get into the game for Boston for the closing seconds. Of. He makes them both. He's got 28. Four seconds, three, two, one. That's good if it goes. It doesn't, and the half is history. And a very impressive first half of work for the Boston Celtics. At the break, they lead it 60-46. Houston Rockets against Kevin Lockery Pullets, who are off to a slow start. And the third quarter gets underway, and Chicago needs to battle back into this thing. We're on a 12-man squad, the other two guys from the scrimmage, the other two guys are referee. Did you ever referee? Oh, yeah, you get, that's a good way to get in fights with your teammates. Bird has 30. Mikhail. I guess arrogance isn't the word for it, but there's just, the, you, like you said, you know you can get it done. Well, Oakley got it done that time from Jordan. Oakley with 14, 68-53. Bird for three. Nope. Jordan no rebound. Nobody there to rebound. Boston. Everybody was surprised he missed. And Jordan needs to explode as he did early in the game. Bird blocked that. McHale the rebound. Dennis Johnson up the floor. Parrish beats Waiters off the dribble. Shoots two. Uh, now that's two free throws. That you yeah, ask yourself on Michael Jordan as well. You ask yourself, is it worth it? Bird makes the tee. He's got 31. John Jordan heads the other way with 7:15 left third quarter. Chicago needs to get hot. Dennis Johnson the foul. There's the start. Jordan the hoop. Yes. Just he came out of the flex position. It's his fourth foul. Jordan now with 24. He had 15 of those in the first quarter. Bird threw it away. Jordan the interception. 10 on the shot clock. 6.45 in the period. Jordan jumps in. At one go. Tipped in. By Oakley. Granville Waiters two on the shot clock. Jordan. 
Illegal, illegal defense against Boston. There's a break. Larry Bird. With the 24 second clock, why don't they just let him play his own? Jordan. Yes. Chicago knocks at the door. Jordan with 27. It's an eight point game, 73 65. It was 17 earlier in this quarter. Bird one on one with Carrington. He blocked the shot but had to foul the door. That's the way they would get to it. Oh. Boston is killing him. <laughs> it works. It has for the Celtics for a year. Paxson, Bird got a piece of that. No whistle. Seasting against Jordan, who hustled back. Bird, that's two point country. He's got 35, and it's a 12 point game. Again, they can move to within eight. Here comes Paxson. He finds Jordan. And from the outside, Jordan's a better shooter. 4 15 left, third quarter. Roberts, it won't go. Rebound, Waiters knocked away. Oakley with it. They can move to within six. Jordan hangs in the air, yes. Boston calls timeout. This place is up for grabs. The Bulls are back in the ballgame. It's 77-71, and we'll be back. Three on the shot clock. Jordan's aware of that. Twelve in the quarter, 33 on the ninth. Third behind the back, and if Johnson can't control it, Jordan has a three-on-one, keeps it himself. That's a good foul by Sister. And two free throws are, are, don't have as much impact psychologically as a dunk shot would. Also, see that if he passed the ball off and they dunked it, the crowd would be Nuts. still ringing your ears. Three, two, one. The quarter is over. At the end of three, the Bulls are back in it. Celtics 84, Bulls 77. Twelve minutes left. We've got a good one going, William. Yeah, these two guys are went different directions, but they end up in the same place. 84-81, Boston led 71-53. 955. Jordan. The crowd in Chicago is loving this comeback. 9.48 left. Boston 84, Chicago 83. Now this is, uh, I thought Jordan should have gotten a uh, foul on this one on Robert Parrish. Bird is double teamed. This is an off. Parrish has it not loose. Chicago can take the lead. It's good. Off Oakley. The Bulls missed their first chance to Sellers doing a pretty good job on Bird. He misses again. Look at that pass. Paxson has had himself quite a game. Thank you. Jordan changed it. Great shot. Great shot. He's got 39. left. Kiritan against Burr. Almost once. Almost. Jordan goes to the base. Wheels and deals. That's a brilliant shot. As good as they come. Burr takes a wild shot. Parrish the rebound. Yes. Jordan. Good pass. Surprised Oakley. Sellers gets the hook. Jordan, drop it over to Oakley, went to Sellers. Good well, passing. Oakley made an extra pass. Seaston. Yes. Terry Seaston. Jordan, and a foul. Foul on Dennis. Dennis Johnson, I believe. 4 16 left. Does he stay with Dennis or not? He has to. 44 for Jordan. Sees the McHale foul line. Oh, that soft touch saved 
And I see that Doug Collins is going down the stretch with Brad Sellers, which is interesting. Jordan has 45. Bird has 37. How about 46? How about that? Good fake. You he missed the shot. Harris missed the rebound. McHale got the next. He has 28, 8 in the quarter, and again, it's a six point game from Bird. Harris set the pick. Roll low to Parrish. Down low to McHale. Yes. McHale, Parrish. Uh oh. Boston just sort of tiptoed away with this one in the last couple of minutes. They, once Jordan got in the open floor, they conceded in the dunk. Bird plays keep away. It's Bird at the foul line. McHale with four on the clock to Bird. Nope, Parrish uncontested for the layup. It's over. Michael Jordan has scored 48, but Boston, as they usually do, won the game. 110-98 the final, and we'll be back right after this.